Hello everyone and welcome to another tutorial. And in this tutorial, uh, we will learn how to detect uh, the alphanumeric keys in Scratch. So when you go to the sensing category and you get the keys pressed, here you only get the numeric keys, alphabetic keys, the arrow keys and the space key. And uh, if you're thinking that any key would work, uh, the any option that any only contains of the uh, alpha alpha and then uh, alphabets, the numerics and the arrow keys and the space. OK, so now I will tell you how can we detect alpha numeric keys. OK, so uh, we'll get a when clicked. OK, and uh, then a forever loop. Then we will get a say block. Fine. And then we'll put the key here. Now, uh, say we'll put space and we'll run the project. Now, if I put space, uh, it says true, right? Now, uh, I will tell you the main key of this video. So, we will get join, fine. The second slot will be exactly blank, okay? And the first uh, slot will be the alpha numeric key that you want to uh, detect. Say I put uh, exclamation mark or an at so that and then we can also put an hashtag so that then we can put a dollar sign or a percentage or power to and like anything any alphanumeric keys uh, we can put here so that uh, Scratch can detect it. Now, the same thing you can uh, also type enter here so that we can uh, get enter. Now, uh, you will think that we can also use this for shift. Why can't we use this for shift? Uh, control uh, that. So, if you try to do that, uh, it won't work. Shift. Okay, I'm pressing shift. So, it doesn't come just says false so that's the thing if you put uh say alt okay and i press alt it won't work it won't work it it only works for enter and the alpha numeric keys all the alpha numeric keys it works for say so i do this so it works all the alpha numeric keys and the enter block enter text so this works for that that's the end of this tutorial and uh, hope you enjoyed it. Please subscribe to our channel and see you soon.